Hello friends, welcome in OCP technology. My name is Shripal and today I am going to demonstrate you how to check corrupted block in your database logically and physically. Actually, uh, we have two types of corruptions. One is uh, physically and one is logically. Okay. Uh, if your uh, hard drive, if you are, you have any hard drive corruptions, then means this is the physical corruption. But if you have any uh, table like uh, corruption, so so it is a logically back block corruption. Okay. So let's see how to check physically block corruption and logically block corruption. So just open your terminal. Firstly, I'm going to uh, going to uh, show you how to check physically block corruption. So for that, for physically block corruption, we have a command dbv dpv database verify <coughs> database block verify command okay so using that command we can uh, check the physically block corruption in our data files okay so like suppose uh, if you have need any help so you can uh, run here help command it's showing all the uh, command of which is we can run with the dbv okay so let's see let's check suppose we have a data file which is name is users or system anything so uh, we can run here dbv file is equal to suppose uh, my data file path is uh, oracle or data Partial and users zero one. Okay, so just enter. It's showing all the detail. If any block is corrupted, so it's mark here. So right now we have zero block corruptions in the our physically data file. Okay, so okay, this is the uh, physically block corruption command checking. Okay, and uh, if you want to check uh, any logical block corruption so you can use the uh, uh, analyze command so for that uh, 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 checking we have need to log in with the uh, login in database so just log in, in your database and just run here analyze table suppose i want to check the table which is name is uh, emp which is under in scott user okay scott dot emp okay validate structure cascade just enter so it's showing table analyze if it is not showing table analyze it's showing any error if any any block is corrupted in that table so it's showing error here error okay so that is uh, these all two tab two commands which is we can use the check physically block corruption and logically block corruption okay okay friends we have uh, two parameters db block check checking show parameter db underscore block checking uh, with the help of this parameter we can check your physically block corruption is check or not and logically block corruption is check or not by default so right now i'm running db block checking that's uh, the uh, parameter which is check the physically block corruption or not showing so by default its value is false that means your 
logically block option checking is false okay but if you uh, run checksum it's showing it is a, a physically block for the block physically blocked option that parameter we use the we use for physically blocked option so its value by default is true or typical okay so right now it is typical that means your physically blocked option is automatically checked by Oracle server okay so let's see how to uh, corrupt a block and uh, how to recover it so friends before uh, now I'm going to corrupt a block but uh, before uh, corrupting any block we should have need a full backup of our database using our man okay so friend <coughs> now I'm going to take the full backup of our man okay so for that I'm um, open a new tab and just armen target just right here backup database okay backup is completed so now friend I'm going to uh, corrupt a block okay just drop on a new terminal and uh, be carefully okay so we have a command for corrupting a block actually dd of is equal to your data file name path full path with full path okay which is zero one and block size eight one nine two eight one nine two and convert not trunk seek is equal to five then enter okay just enter now type here some anything else okay then right here eof end of file okay just after that control c press control plus c okay now <coughs> now you have a corrupted block you can check using dbv file and your file name so you can see here the block corrupted or not you can check you have a total page mark corrupted one okay so friend that is the command <coughs> which is we can use for corrupted a block okay for corruption of a block right so now how to recover that corrupted block right so let's see how to recover that block we have need to go on rman prompt and using that block using rman okay so just right here block 
recover data file for block number 5 actually uh, we have information here which block and which data file is corrupted so you can see here file number 4 and block number 5 is corrupted okay so I'm right here same like that data file number 4 and block number 5 okay so just enter it's going to recover your block so it is finished now check again your block is corrupted or not right now is recover or not okay so you can see here your page are corrupted is zero that means your physically block corruption is removed okay friends so friend this this method you can use your uh, use uh, for use uh, corrupted any block corrupt any block and recover it but you should have mandatory Armen backup if you don't have Armen backup you cannot recover that block corruption okay so I hope you found that video very informatic and uh, please subscribe my channel and like my video thanks for watching